Greetings, Earthlings! My name is Capacity Moon 90 and welcome to a game that I really should have played a long, 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 long time ago. This is, um... Um... Back for Blood? I believe that's what it's called. And it looks like it's the Halloween edition, so it looks like I'm doing it just in time. I don't know when, I don't know where, but I don't know what, what I'm gonna do. What can I do for you? Oh, you can tell me what's happening. Oh, you'll be glad you stopped by. Now, uh, Dex? Want to unlock cards or cosmetics? Uh. Then you need to earn supply points. The heck? Complete maps and challenges in campaign and swarm mode. To what? receive supply points for your efforts as you play. <laughs> what the heck? Supply lines offer multiple reward tracks with a variety of content to choose from. Progress through these tracks by purchasing unlocks with your supply points. Complete one and unlock new tracks to progress on. Take on challenges, earn supply um. points, and complete supply lines to earn incredible rewards. You'll unlock everything from game changing cards to killer cosmetics. Yeah. So, what are you waiting for? Get out there and show me what you've got. Yeah, uh, speaking of campaign, that's what I'd like to do. Just gotta find it first. Uh... There's a new world out there. A ridden. Holy crap, what the, the heck is that? You can get. That's where the card system comes into play. Stack your deck with cards that can help turn the tide of battle. Player cards make you stronger and can give you the edge you need in your fight against the ridden. And believe the me, what? you'll need it. As the director will be playing corruption cards to try and stop you. At the beginning of each run, and every time you enter a safe room, the director will modify and randomize gameplay with corruption cards. This ensures that no two playthroughs are ever the same. This doesn't seem like... Each player has their own deck of player cards that can help themselves and their team through buffs, boosts, damage resistance, and more. After you know what you're up against, you can attempt to count Wait, did that zombie have four arms? With your own player cards. Your active cards appear on the hub screen. Once you draw cards from your deck and play them in your hand, a lock, cocked, and ready to rock. Then it's time to kick some ridden ass. Wanna jump right into Rick? the action? Just select preset deck or dive in and create your own. Select from a wide variety of cards that support your playstyle. From medic to melee and everything in between. Player cards can also be gained in-game and from vendor cases. Whatever you want to do, it's all in the cards. But choose wisely, as you'll draw your cards in the order you assembled your deck. At each starting safe room, you'll be able to draw up to your max hand. Just remember, forward thinking is the foundation of good strategy. In summation, use a pre-built deck or build your own. Counter corruption wow. cards with player cards. It's up to you now, cleaner. Go give them hell. I don't know if I'm going to be as good as the players in those videos, but I'm at least going to try. So let's start off at the beginning. Every time you walk out that safe room door, you begin a run. There's no way back after that. So before you step out that door, here's what you need to know. Okay, campaign rules. If you're the party leader, there's a set of crucial decisions to be made before the run even begins. Each unique run is high stakes. If you fail, you and your team can use a continue, but fail too many times, and you'll have to do the entire run over again. Oh, jeez. Don't be discouraged. Failure is not the end. Unlock cards, edit your deck, and then get back into it. Run out of continues? To create a new run from your last starting point. A starting point is unlocked by reaching certain designated safe rooms. Looking for a bigger fight? Increase the difficulty of your run. Each difficulty presents its own unique challenges and obstacles. Stronger ridden encounters, deadly hazards, and lethal friendly fire are just some of the hurdles faced when you ramp up the difficulty. Why would I want the lethal the friendly fire? The more you and your team will need to work together to survive. But with greater risk comes greater reward. Succeeding harder runs will earn you more supply points to spend on unlocks. Okay. Remember, you're not in this alone. 
So be sure to invite your friends on your campaign runs. Need some R&R? &R? Leave the game while in a safe room with no penalty and finish your run later. Are you up for the challenge of a nightmare run? Take your friends with you and don't stop slaying until you've reached the end of the road. Now do your job and get to cleaning up those streets. <sighs> okay, back for blood. All right, let's um can we actually get started? I don't think <clears throat> Anyways, I'm going to get started on this because I have... And I'm going to start on Rookie because I have no idea what I'm going to get myself into. I know I'm definitely not a veteran. And I know you guys definitely know that I am not a veteran. Anyways, let's just get into the game. Let's have a nice, calm, gentle, decent time. And we're all going to be nice and easy. Well, technically not easy, but I don't know. I want to see where this goes. I've never played this game before. I don't know anything about it. Oh, it's like Left 4 Dead, except these zombies are different. Walker, Chris, good to see you. Chris, Mom. <coughs> Jeez. <laughs> Long time no see. Hello. I was beginning to think you weren't coming. Oh. No Thank more freebies, Ren. You want the supplies? You need to put aside your difference with Phillips. Yeah, I'm done playing soldiers for him. You should be too. Come on, Chris. Look, don't tell me you're still falling for his BS. Especially after what happened to Chase. Don't bring my son into this. Look, you know how I feel about Phillips. But he's um, right. This is a war. The generals just cling into the glory days. There's no chief left to hail to. Not that I'd want to. Look. I get it. No, you don't. Okay, we're surviving here. Rebuilding. Surviving's not enough. We got to fight. Now we don't need to do anything. All right, when was the last time you saw written in any numbers? Hmm? Jesus. Oh, damn. Oh, what the what? That thing's got parasites! Dripping ceilings. You don't like that. Oh, see? That's exactly what I was talking about. Where did these worms even come from? Why is this happening? And what on earth were those things? Or were they even from Earth? Is it possible that this infection came from a far off... Let's see. 
I can place ever I want. Oh man, there's lots of choices. <laughs> I like that guy. But she's got a machine gun. And I do like it when chicks have machine guns. Hmm. And again, she's obviously the intelligent one. So she knows what she's doing. And she looks like she's been through it before. <laughs> uh. Ah, it's so difficult. I'm gonna go with... I'll go with Jim. Times are wasted. As a starter. Sorry, it took me so long to actually pick. Uh, lock in. Whatever that means. Okay. Okay, so. Oh, okay. Well, this is great. Worrying ain't never solved nothing. Over two. This is Hope One. Do you copy? We're here. Barely. Need all cleaners back at the Ville. Pronto. Hard copy? Yes, sir. Hope One out. Well, let's move. Uh, wait. Um. Let's get this. Don't rightly mind if I do. Best to get what you need here than trying to find it out there. Well, okay. Uh. Careful! Slow down a sec. I don't have any flashlights? And I just wasted that? Alright, I. Alright, 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 I get your point. Go. We got company. Let's hit the road. Good job. I got an achievement. Oof. And stay down. Not exactly what I was picturing in the zombie apocalypse. Over there. Away. Oh, that's how I mark things. Need to get up high. See the lay of the land. See what trouble we're getting into. Reloading! Stabby, stabby! What the hell was that? Huh. I'll take that. Oh, it's money. <laughs> uh, take a look, see. Ew, worms! Ew, worms! I hate oh, yeah. worms. Ugh, and then again, who doesn't hate worms? It's like monsters inside of me. Have you seen that TV show? Oh boy, have I seen it. Intel here. Oh yeah, sure. Like I'd use a bow in the zombie. Maybe when sneaky. Maybe when sneaky. Oh, my deck? Um. Oh, man. Look, I don't even know what I'm doing here. But I'm gonna at least. Since when do zombies laugh, talk, or take human form without a host? There. Ooh. Uh, need that. Cover me. Huh? This would be so much easier if I had a flashlight on me. What is this? Back it in this. See that? Ooh, peaches. I love peaches. There. Lower the bridge. 
Why? What's the worst that could happen? Did you say singer? Um, I thought I. Why are the subtitles so damn small or not on? Or why does it have to make me so irritated? Uh, uh, let's just keep moving. Guess like that. Gotta take care of this. Watch out! Ah! Fire! Move big time! Move ahead! Um. Locked! Gas can over there! What's a gas can gonna do? I mean, other than burn the entire Don't place. Mind if I do. What if? This usually works on TV! Yeah, shouldn't have trusted it. What's down here? Oh! Uh, uh, say that again? Oh, I am. <clears throat> the fatherly light said. They're all dead! Oh, so at least I know I can kill myself. Not this guy. Um. I guess I'll have to look back at that. Yeesh. Hey. Can I become Jim or is it too late for me? Ha! Didn't see that coming, did you? Oh, I am Jim again. This is so confusing. It's like these zombies are easy to kill. Well, obviously it's because I'm not easy. This reminds me so much of Left 4 Dead. Of course, you know, I actually no, I'm gonna say it out loud. That's a big exploder. Like I said, how did I like I asked, my questions were not answered. How did all this happen? Dead end. Uh, yeah, but we still got peaches. I love peaches. Oh, duh. Oh, he's dead. A tall boy? That's what you're calling him? Well, at least these guys are a little, a little bit easier to kill. Okay, so someone asked for our help. The safe zone. I gotta get to the safe zone. Oh, there it is. There's a lot of toilets. That shows you how much this game is. I can this. Oh, what's this? 
Hello. I'll take that. Oh, it's an attachment. Yeah. Hello. Habushki. Why are you not dead? Okay, now. Oh, shut up. Well, that answers that question. That wasn't too bad of a game. I liked it. Um, so that was only like Act 1. But I would like to see more of this game later on. But first off, I'd like to say... Thank you everybody so much for watching. Make sure to hit that like button, share, and or subscribe. If you'd like to see more content, don't worry. There's going to be more on the way. So, thank you. And, uh, oh, I can rate that. I'm going to give it a 2 because I'm not entirely 100% sure about that. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye. Greetings, Earthlings. My name is Capacity Mode 90, and welcome to play. Let's play XCOM: Enemy Within.